Hi, my name is Jeff Dixon, and this is a special episode of the Church at 434 in Motion because it has been one year since our thousandth episode. And on our thousandth episode, we challenged you to spend an entire year doing a thousand things that would draw you closer in your walk with God, to Him, to being the best version of yourselves, and to doing the things that you were created to do. Now, uh, you could have done anything. It could have been praying. It could have been learning God's Word. It could be encouraging others. It could be uh, giving a gift. It could be uh, washing a car. But three times a day, you had to do these things. And so the idea was to do a thousand of them, journal it, keep record of it so that you knew when a year was up, you could look back and say, you know, I, I was able to do a thousand things that I wouldn't have done had I not taken the time uh, to really make the effort uh, to get it right. And so here we are. How did you do? Did you have a successful year? If you did a thousand things, kudos to you, way to go. If you only did 500, what happened to you? Did you get worn out? But you know what, that's still, that's 500 more than you would have done. If you did a hundred, that's still a hundred more than you would have done. Think about that. It, 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 it only took one thing a day to do 365. See, and sometimes we forget that it doesn't take a lot to be a big blessing. And that's the lesson that I hope that you learned along the way. I hope that you had a lot of joy. I hope that you had a lot of fun. I hope that you uh, really just blessed the socks off other people. I really hope that you've gone closer to God in your walk with Him simply because we challenged you to do something, something different, three times a day. If you didn't, that's okay. The new year's coming. You can start all over again. Thanks for taking the challenge. Thanks for being a part of the church at 434 in motion. And thanks for touching and changing the world with the love of God.